Hey, welcome back to Job with Jason. This week's topic is the importance of making a strategic plan when purchasing a house, all right? So here's what a really good pre-approval or mortgage plan looks like, okay? You call up the lender, they typically have you apply online with an online application. That's important to get all the data over where you've been working the past two years, where you've been living the past two years, income and assets. They'll take that with a credit report and they'll get a good 30,000 foot view of where you're at, okay? They'll run you through a system called the Automated Underwriting System called AUS and will give you an automated loan approval, okay? That's the first step. The second step is to actually meet with your loan officer. They will give you an in-depth consultation, or they should. They should go over down payment, monthly payment, interest rates, and they should give you a fees worksheet that shows you all the possible fees and charges you might see when buying a house. There should be no surprises when you go out shopping. You should know what a 10% down $300,000 house looks like if that's what you're doing, okay? And they should go over tax rates and local market areas Area, so you'll know what's going on in the different surrounding areas, okay? On top of that, the third step is they collect all your documents, okay? And they will review all your documents. They'll look at your paycheck stubs, your tax returns. They'll look at your asset statements. They'll go through with a fine tooth comb and validate the information you gave us. That will help them when you make the offer, you can tell them you're fully pre-approved, not some pre-qualification like the big banks and online lenders, that something's already been reviewed, okay? And then from there, as you go out shopping, a good lender should run monthly payments for any house you look at and come up with cash to close as well too because it gets way more detailed. You can get way more detailed when you have a specific property. And lastly, a good lender should call the listing agent. They should vouch for you when you make the offer. Make sure that, they, that you know and that they know that you have a really good offer. If you have any questions on this, this is what a true strategic plan looks like when helping get, helping you get a house in this, in this crazy seller's market. Talk to you soon.